uh, welcome to the data feature lab channel uh, this is shaker so so previously we have seen uh, three, three uh, coding uh, python inter questions one is uh, how to sort the list in ascending or descending order without using a built-in function that is sort then Fibonacci series we have seen uh, we can print it uh, n number of terms and also we can print nth term by using the Fibonacci uh, by using a recursion as well as the, the general function uh, we have seen how to print the nth term uh, of Fibonacci series and last questions we are going to see that uh, how to create the dictionary of uh, uh, key value uh, pair that's a key value pair where the key is the character of this in the string and uh, uh, and its occurrence or its frequency in that particular string that we have to see suppose the string is um, I'll say string one is equal to uh, data I will say it's data future future lab. Okay, data future lab. So uh, what I need to do? So I want the each and every character and its um, its occurrence. Okay. So what I'll do? I'll create a dict one. So dict one is is empty dictionary and i'll run the for loop for string is one and uh, what i'll do so pick to one of uh, cat is equal to its occurrence so its occurrence is a string one dot count of count of cat okay so that's all so here if you print dict one uh, uh, okay sorry in here is in is missing yo so here you can see this sd is um, occurring one time a is occurring three times t is two times like this so this is the dictionary of the character and its occurrence Mm, one more approach is there so here the dictionary uh, yes the same string so we will create a dictionary to dictionary to is again uh, this thing so for um, character in string one okay, it's the same again um, if um if car uh, not in uh, not in dict two then what we are do so dict two of car um equal to dict um okay so if this character is already in the dict then we have to add the count okay so yeah and it's a plus one so every time it will keep on adding this okay and else else uh, else what we have to print so this dict two of cap equal to one okay and then we have to check the dict um char is not defined so here is ch a r okay char is not defined you can see here the same output you can see here so this is the second approach where you can uh, see uh the character and its occurrence by using a dictionary so this is also very important uh, interview question so create a dictionary of the character and its occurrence in that particular state. Thank you.